guys, it's Diana from the couch again. I know we've been talking about potatoes a lot and being a couch potato, but you know what? Sometimes life hands you lemons. So today we're going to use a lemon um, and we're going to squish it. So it needs to be a hard, not a Meyer lemon, but a hard one. Um, and first we're going to take a few little stretches with it, right? So reach up high on either side yeah, and do it a couple times. Again, when you're doing this on your own, you can do more repetitions. We'll get it a little, uh, wake up our hands a little bit, squeezing it in between, squeezing from one hand to the other. And then we'll take it down our, our thighs, wake up our, our thighs by rolling that lemon on your thighs. And down your shins. Yeah, this is a good stretch too. Maybe underneath your legs, little leg lifts. Again, you can do as many as you want, right? And when you're ready, come off to the edge of the couch here again. And take the lemon and use it under your foot. Again, don't squish too hard, but squish hard enough so you feel all, um, all the different points in the bottom of your feet. It's really good for your feet. And we do it on the other foot, underneath. And then go ahead and pick up your lemon. Again, take a nice stretch. Maybe both arms reaching as high as you can go. Make sure your feet are back behind you. You're over. Uh, lifting your butt for it to come off the couch. We'll reach up. And then we'll take a nice uh, lengthening up to get over to our kitchen where we're going to use our lemon yeah. and we're going to need a little jar to put the lemon juice in knife it's a big one a mug for your drink you're making cinnamon which you can either do powdered or cinnamon stick and honey so we're going to take the lemon which is now really soft um, so it should be easy to cut and cut it in half and then we're going to squeeze the halves of the lemon into the jar. See, it squeezes really nice. For the purposes of the video, I'll only squeeze one half. Yeah. And then <clears throat> you have the lemon to save for later when you want to make your hot toddy. You just pour a teeny bit of the lemon in. Your cinnamon stick, which you can use over and over again throughout the day. A little bit of honey, or maybe more if you like honey. And then add a little hot water and you have your hot toddy. So enjoy. 